The suspected cop killer made his first appearance here in Stanislaus County Court today, and we learned his proceedings have been suspended pending a doctor's report on his own mental competency. I love you guys. Corporal Renil Singh's family and close friends were greeted by dozens of strangers hoping to show their support outside of the courthouse. We want them to know that we love them and we are behind them. Also applauding Newman police officers as they walked into court to face their colleague's suspected killer. We just wanted the family to know that as they go in to face their loved ones murderer face to face that we are out here in front of the courthouse supporting them and that we have their back. We all want justice. Carrie Crane is a co-founder of a group called Stand Together to Make a Change. She recently created this group as Corporal Singh's death hit too close to home. Her husband is also in law enforcement. Today our only focus is to show love and support to Ranil Singh and his entire family. This group eventually has plans to take their concerns with California sanctuary laws up to the Capitol. As investigators say, Ariaga was in this country illegally with two prior DUI arrests and ties to local gangs. And if California didn't have sanctuary state status or all of these various sanctuary cities, we might not have had something like this happen. But they say they are just focused on supporting the family for now and will keep coming back to future court appearances for as long as it takes. I will come back as often as I can because they need to know. They need to know that they are supported. The suspect is expected to appear back in court here in five weeks, and that is the earliest we could hear a possible plea from him. In Stanislaus County, Lena Howland, ABC 10 News.